Well, I, I think that FERPA already, um, with all of its limitations and flaws, you have to remember FERPA was a statute that was adopted in the 70s, um, you know, before the Internet even existed as we know it, um, and hasn't changed much of it all since. Um, so one of the problems for us is trying to take these definitions and concepts and legal doctrines that have developed under FERPA and kind of stretch them to, to fit the current reality of life in the digital age. So one of our challenges in, 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 in complying with FERPA is understanding what the legislature back in the 70s really intended it to mean. Um, the good news, if you can call it that, is uh, it's actually good news and bad news in a sense, is that um, because our, based on a ruling of our U.S. Supreme Court, school districts face so little legal liability for violating FERPA, and really their only legal sanction they would face is withholding of federal funds, which if it's ever happened at all, um, I, I, I'm unaware of it. it. may have happened, but certainly nothing that school districts are realistically aware of. Th that's, that's good news in the sense that I'm um, all for school districts not facing additional liability beyond the millions of other laws that already uh, confront them with that. Um, the bad news, though, is, is you know school officials, with all the laws they're required to comply with, oftentimes just from the sake of survival, will prioritize their time to focus on the issues where the, they, they face the biggest li liability for screwing up, if you will. And I think that the absence of liability may explain uh, if not excuse why this has not been a high priority issue before. Um, so before somebody starts creating legal liability for these violations, that's another reason why I and my colleagues around the country are trying to encourage our school districts to get into compliance so that uh, no one feels the need to impose extra sanctions because we're all doing it the right way.